Hey guys, it's Tim from Collect Jurassic here with a quick video. Wanted to talk about a couple recent releases um, that we saw over the weekend. A um, couple peaks and things. All of these coming out of uh, Central and South America. This first one is the Battle Damage Plesiosaurus. It's been spotted and purchased at a store in Mexico City by collector Irving H. Um, put these pictures up on Facebook, but yeah, you can see in package the battle damage please you that everyone is very excited about myself included um he also did post pictures of the scan code i know people are obsessed with the, the scan codes um so i'll include that picture here but yeah uh looks like the figure is finally making its way to stores hopefully coming to the u.s uh soon enough but yeah it just looks excellent um one thing to note I, a couple people have already commented on how small the plesiosaur is but this is actually the correct size for the dinosaur or sorry for the swimming reptile not a dinosaur um they were a little bit smaller in size if you're expecting to see a, a, a giant swimming one um i think you're thinking of the elasmosaur but no this plesiosaur is scaled correctly and the figure just looks awesome can't wait to get another aquatic reptile like the mosasaur hope this is the first of many um but yeah awesome figure next up we have these legacy collection story packs that were spotted in chile um, of all places at a mattel store i guess they have mattel stores uh down in chile and this one was spotted in santiago um two sets alan grant and muldoon but the alan grant set is probably the coolest features a slight variant of alan grant with gray pants and then a repaint female jurassic park 3 raptor couple eggs and a satchel to carry the eggs in set looks awesome um love the repainted raptor and the eggs nice little accessories for the mattel jurassic line but yeah spotted in chile along with the robert muldoon story pack that comes with a raptor that may or may not be a straight repack hard to tell with these pictures if the color is a little different but also comes with robert muldoon who is a repack with no variation on that figure as well a little concerning that these figures were showing up first in chile um legacy collections usually you know spotted at target here in the u.s first so a little worried about what that means for these figures are they actually going to be coming out or what um legacy collection is you know always been a little troubling at target as far as distribution goes and a couple dinosaurs that have been canceled so we'll see and keep you updated that's all i got for today again i'm tim from collect jurassic be sure to head to the website for more pictures and information on these latest toy sightings.